Hi, welcome back to the second part of how to animate your Android app part 3. It's time to write the Java code of this application. First, open the man main activity.java and first set the view class, the subclass of linear layout and its private view container and two more variables that is hello and another is profile now link this objects from XML to the main activity container find view by ID r dot id dot container and similarly for the text view reference of hello variable is find view by id r dot id dot welcome and for the profile r dot id dot profile now we are going to write the code for animation to associate animation with our view we are call the animation method now we have to override the method on window focus change to make sure animation run only once we have to write private boolean play animation is true and within on window focus change method write if has focus and play animation then call the show container method now we are going to create a new method that is show container private void show container and we are going to create another method show other items to create motion twin we need to determine the initial and final coordinates of the text message here is another method now set play animation to false now uh, with this code animation will run correctly 
as the app start through it will start as the every time the app gain start but to fix it declare play animations to true but inside this on window focus change method play animation set to false now we are going to write the code for animation so associate with our view and to animate the alpha property call alpha method now within the method so other items determine the x coordinate now the extreme left coordinate is zero so play the view fully outside the container we subtract its width from zero now determine ending x coordinate just use the get x method as our view is in the final position hello dot get x now we have to start with the end values we can create animation so we will use the float variable and object animator we will use the object animator class we will use float variable so use a float method first send a text view then the view dot x as we are animating the x coordinate and then the start and end values this first one is hello this is text and second one is view dot x this x coordinate and then the start and the end values now set the duration to increase the animation time and now start the animation and now set the visibility of your text to visible as the property of the text is invisible during the loading of this application now create property values holder for scale x property use offload method to initialize as the scale x is offload now send the scale x property to animate here and the end values we sent property values holder dot offload this view dot scale x and value 1 and similarly for the y coordinate 
that is for scale y now last of all need to animate the profile pic this anim profile is equals to object animator dot of property values holder profile next value scale x holder and then scale y holder and save it and that an in profile or set duration to increase the duration of the animation and then start the animation So let's check how the application works. This completes the coding. So that's it. Back to all of you with a new exciting topic on Android programming. So download source code from uanblog.com. On every Tuesday, you will get new tutorials on Android and on Sunday, our gaming video. So subscribe Multi Android Zone for latest update, download Multi Android Zone YouTube app and stay tuned. See you soon.